We are going back 26 years. We're going to do this right now to revisit a report from the late, great Tom Fenton, an award-winning reporter with CBS News, known as the Dean of American Foreign Correspondents. In this memory, Fenton was assigned to a story of century-old bottles of champagne found at the bottom of the ocean. He even had a chance to sample one. From the depths of the Baltic Sea has come a treasure trove of liquid gold, 91-year-old Heidsick Champagne, thousands of bottles of it. They were bound for the Tsar's army in World War I when the ship was sunk by a German U-boat. Not only still has the fizz, the aroma and taste have mellowed in more than 80 years at the bottom of the ice-cold sea. In the interest of accurate reporting, we sampled it ourselves. It clearly looked like the real thing. And it tastes like champagne. Wonderful. Wonderful. Just a little sweet taste and a bit of the nuttiness. 1907, wonderful year. That's what we like to call original reporting here at CBS News. And, and, and he went that extra mile tasting it. I became really interested in this story. It was found in the Baltic Sea, that uh, cache of champagne. But the, about 10 years later, 15 years later, there was another cache found from 1780. Oh, I think I remember this. And it's the oldest known recovered champagne. Uh, people popped the top on deck, and it was still bubbly, still good. That's unbelievable. There's something magical about the Baltic in yeah. particular. Um, because it's so deep, dark, and there's not a lot of oxygen down there, so it's like the perfect storage.